Well, you've been to chili cook-offs and you've probably been to barbecue events, but possibly the most prestigious of them all, Silos Brewing Company. Um, it's having a steak cook-off and festival happening Saturday at Old Market Square in Easley. It's going to be the place to be this weekend. So we've got Glenn Brown the third liaison to all things steak and beer. Is that correct? That's Absolutely. Your title? Along Absolutely. with Jim Anderson, a member of the Steak Cook-Off Association and a competitor as well. Welcome to you both. I appreciate you being Thank here. You. Thanks um, for having us. We also want to say welcome to a few brewers from silos they are standing by with with some of the product there you can see uh, they're situated with a few with a few beer cans to uh, lend some moral support right so definitely a, a fun crew that you're working with on this for sure um, now as we get into uh, in the names of the brewers back there Kenny Driggers and Nate Powell worth another hello cheers anyway um, first Glenn give us the overview what happens during the state cook-off and festival so we're really excited to have the Steak Cook-Off Association come to Easley. Mm -hmm. It's going to be in Old Market Square this Saturday. Reminder, buy your tickets by tomorrow. All buy right. your tickets by tomorrow. We can't wait to see you out there. We have a vendor village. Yeah. Shout out to Ash and Ivy on providing all the vendors for the event. We have everything you possibly want. We got DJ AVX yeah, we've rocking got the, the amphitheater. It's going to be incredible. We have the nation's best steak Comp competitors cooking, Jim included. Yeah, let me get included. into that because Jim, be as a competitor and SCA member, there's a lot of pride with making a fantastic steak. So tell us what, what have you all brought here in front of us? Absolutely. We, we're just displaying here uh, a fresh ribeye uh, steak. So each competitor, they pick their own steaks for this competition when they show up. Uh -huh. And uh, here we're just displaying how they could look like when they're finished. Um, yeah, it is a lot of pride of just spending hours and hours and hours yeah. on one single steak. And, and you know people who just, they love making a steak so much, and they'd put their steak up against anybody else's. Is that the spirit of competition here? Absolutely, but at the same time, very family. Um, yeah. Everybody loves to hang out with each other. Uh, everybody's supporting each other, and uh, it's just a fun event for any backyard cook to a professional chef. Yeah, it's fantastic. For all the competitors in the Silos Brewing Company Steak Cook-Off, there's bragging rights, and Glenn, there's there's... Prize money at stake, too, right? Prize money. Yeah. Not only prize money, but prizes. Up to $8,000 in total prizes. We have a People's Choice competition. Come on down. Try the nation's best steak. Walk the vendor village. Again, we can't thank you enough. Yeah. And I want to actually send a shout out to our sponsors. We have Quality Granite Cabinets and Flooring. We have State Farm. And we have... <laughs> We'll have all those well, on the website, oh too, because there's I'm so many you. different people involved. And there are categories for beer-infused yes. appetizer. There's categories for kid chefs, too. Is that right? Yes, That's right. absolutely. Yep. Very cool. Um, absolutely. And aside from the steak food portion of this festival, um, I read that there was knife throwing as one of the events. How's, how's that going to go? Knife throwing is going to be incredible. <laughs> so we have 312 uh, throwing out of Easley. Okay. They are one of our partners. They're the pros. They're the pros. Come on down. Grab a chef knife and knife throwing. I yeah. mean, come on. Knife and throwing, steak, craft beer. Are you kidding? That's it. And and also brewmasters are on hand. The brew, the guys who brew this beer will probably be lingering around. They're there to wave at you. They're there to answer the questions. They're there to help you pick out which beer you like out of the variety that, that they'll have out there. So really, really a fun event. Uh, merchants, vendors, and live music, too. Anything else that you want people to know about this day-long event Saturday? Day-long event. Definitely come on out. I do want to share with everyone that we have our King of the Cul-de-Sac competition, too. Uh -huh. Let's say you're not one of the nation's best steak competitors, and you just love to grill. Come on out, because the first place competitor, the first place non-competitor that wins the King of the Cul-de-Sac gets all this right in front of that you. That is an excellent price right there. That's yes. reason to come out. I mean, it's going to be an incredible event. And you guys have a lot of fun at Silos. Talk to us about the, the scene there. We're showing some pictures for anybody who hasn't been to the brewery. Look, the Silos, what a fixture uh -huh. in Pickens County in the upstate. It was built in 1947, and it was an active working silo and grain facility. Many of our, many of our customers who come in, you know, they worked there, or they had family that worked yeah. there. So it truly is special to... Bring that back into the community and open it back up for eyes that may have never even seen it before. Well, it's going to be a fabulous time. We really appreciate the preview and, and really filling in something to do on Saturday. The Silos Brewing Company um, Steak Cook-Off. Steak Cook-Off. You got it. Amazing. And have an excellent steak cook-off. It's at Market 
square in easily. Uh, day long event Saturday starts at 7 a.m. with the load in. Cooks meet at 10 a.m. Awards start at 6. Make it a great one, guys. Thank you so you much got for the it. Fun. You. you got it. And be on the lookout for our Take Aim. That's our cold IPA. You'll see it in stores soon.